Hey, what's up guys? It's Marquez from the MKBHD YouTube channel, back with another HD video of the Chrome Web Store. Now, I know you don't have to search through it using Google Voice Search, but I figured I'd show you guys you can do that with Chrome also anyway. But go ahead and hit the uh, new tab page in Chrome, and you'll also have the option to visit it right here along with the other app shortcuts. But here is the brand new overview of the Chrome Web Store. It is looking really, really good. You can click on the link in the description to check it out yourself. Up here you have a preview of all the most popular apps or the featured ones and if you scroll down you have all the panes with the uh, the icons if you will of the less popular apps but all the rest of the apps uh, that are featured here on the home page these are all the best of the best applications so you can see some of these are larger and some of these are smaller thumbnails just like in google plus and if you go ahead and hover over one of them you'll have the option to add it to chrome immediately or click on it and view the little pane where you can view all the information about the app. So here you can give it a plus one on Google Plus. If you want to add me on Google Plus, that's in the description too. You can add it to Chrome directly, view all the screenshots, and even view a YouTube video that the company may have chosen to embed. And you can view the details of the app. Of course, they can add all that kind of stuff too, their website, and all the user reviews. You can leave a review too if you install an application, so that's very helpful. Go ahead and exit out of that here. If you see one of the larger panels, you can go directly to the right to view screenshots of that app. So all the featured apps that are have these massive panels here, you can view screenshots of them just by clicking the right and left arrows. So that's pretty convenient. Also, you notice my scroll ball is tiny. That's because you can scroll infinitely through applications. Infinite scrolling through as many apps as you want, and eventually at a certain point it gets to these smaller panes. I think you have to scroll for quite a while though. Here you go. So now you have only smaller panes for all the apps, but you still get to go through infinite scroll, which is really convenient if you just want to waste time in the Chrome Web Store. Over on the left is of course your search and all your categories. This can also, uh, there are paid apps here, but you can also get some extensions. So there's extension categories, there's social and communication, there's fun, there's news and weather extensions, things like that. And once you sort by category, it gives you a whole new page. Again, large panes and small panes. So here's a whole bunch of different screenshots of Bouncy Mouse. You can add it to Chrome immediately or check out these other applications here. I'm going to go ahead and search for an app. I'm going to search for a weather app. Even though there's a weather category, I'll search for weather. And you can see this is what it looks like when you search through apps. Again, this is I love the redesigns that Google's putting through all their web apps. It's really looking good. Uh, hit the collections button over here and you have a whole bunch of collections of applications. So let's say a money collection. That's a pretty sweet collection of apps right there. Google Finance, Finance 41, a bunch of great apps. I think you guys should check out the Chrome Web Store. It is looking really good. And if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. I'm going to let you guys go ahead and make sure you have the latest version of Chrome and get to exploring it yourself. So thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.